Local patients are benefiting from highly specialized therapy and care after experiencing a traumatic injury. A recently opened rehabilitation center is especially designed for patients who are not quite ready to go home or to a skilled nursing facility. And as I was going out the door, our kitty, Oliver, was coming in the door and we collided and I lost my balance and I went down so fast that I just, there I was on the, on the floor. Oregon resident Evelyn Wagner, who was visiting her daughter in Apopka, was rushed to see an orthopedic specialist. He just said, when you do something, you really do it upright, don't you? <laughs> and he, of course he showed us the x-rays and uh, said he was going to be doing a lot. After surgery, Wagner was referred to the new Advent Health Waterman Inpatient Rehabilitation Unit for specialized therapy, and it is a lot closer to her daughter. Everybody that comes in is going to get three hours of therapy per day. Um, that's going to be combinations of physical therapy, occupational therapy, speech therapy, um, as well as nursing care, case management, and then physician coverage. Some patients may be uh, too ill, for example, to go straight to a skilled nursing facility or go home, but they're still a little bit more improved or stable to stay in the hospital. And we're kind of that bridge, again, that will take them from that acute care stay in the hospital to that safe, independent discharge home. At first it was just how to get in, out of bed and um, go from my bed to my walker, from my walker to the wheelchair. They have a wonderful new equipment that I've never seen before. That it's like a harness you put around you and it's hooked to the ceiling and so you can't fall. And it holds you up while they teach you how to move your foot with the walker. They have like a car, only it's kind of cut down. It's so we practice that over and over. Out of the wheelchair, to the walker, how to turn around and sit on the edge of the, the car seat and then swing around. And they fix the car seat, however high or far and back, whatever car that you have. When it comes to something, again, as, that we see as simple when we don't have a functional decline is getting inside and out of a car. Firing muscles like your quadriceps and your hamstring around a fractured bone is going to be uh, very different for that post-surgical patient than it would be for somebody who's um, more functionally adept or, or hasn't had that injury before. So if somebody has a, uh, you know, a smaller car that they have to get into versus a pickup truck, we can kind of mimic that a little bit and make it safer for them to again transition into their own independence and, and get out to a safe place. Now home with her daughter, Wagner is progressing with physical therapy and marveling at how far she has come since the accident. They check how I walk, they've improved that, and they do many exercises. Standing and moving my legs and putting more weight on my left leg and uh, just a lot of different exercises. <laughs> You'll find information about the new inpatient rehabilitation unit, the only one of its kind in Lake County, by visiting adventhealthwaterman.com.